Damn it. I stopped recording. So, for those of you who just got back into this second video, cracked open the, oh my gosh, the second pack, uh, the first pack of the second half, and we pulled some doozies, and of course I didn't even get it on the recording. See, look, wait. We got a Mox Opal and Wrath of God, and those are dope, and I love it, and it's great, but I forgot to hit record. But anyways, welcome back to the second half. Cheers. Okay, back. Let's just keep going. Okay. Anywho, clear shot. The Battle Rider, sh Battle Rapid Shaman. Fierce Empath. That's me. I just, I'm so empathetic. Volshock Gauntlets, Magnifying Glass, The Relic Runner, Surge Node, Crusader of Audric. Got Valor and Akros, Thirst for Knowledge. See, he's getting his drink on. So should you. Unless you're in 21, then I don't condone it. Don't. Get a soda. Obliette. What is this? Enchantment. When Obliet enters the battlefield, target creature phases out until Obliet leaves the battlefield. Tap that creature as it phases in this way. Okay. And a rare pure stool steel paladin and the walking ballista. Okay. Right on. And so for foils, we got an ever flowing chalice, just so overflowing. And. Boom, ba boom, boom, ba boom! Foil, Stoneforge Mystic, and a soldier. Oh, right on, right on, right on. We got things to sleeve, people. They like this Mystic. Excellent. And I believe the Walking Ballista. Give me a second. And nah, the Chalice. Camera's getting crooked. Let's go check things out. Okay. What do we got? What do we got? Mm -hmm. A big 24 right there. That's a 10-4, big 24, buddy. Tight. Um, what was the other foil that I saw? Oh, High Market. Oh, no. Regardless, I just like the card, so. Oh, wait. Hearst's Tower. That's a tour. I got that in foil. Where did I put Hearst's Tower? That's a common, common foil. Okay. Uh, hmm. Oh, high market. It's three -er. So there we go. Boom. Mm. All right. Well. Excellent. Wait, okay, what about the ballista? Let me turn this off. Mm. 
Walking ballista. Does anybody hear this chirping kitty that is behind me? She craves for attention. Yeah, walking ballista's 10. This cat is striving for my attention. And I love her, and I will give it to her eventually. We got stuff to do, folks. We got stuff to do. Um. Oh, you gotta get, you gotta, you gotta get up. It's rough being a dad. It really is. You gotta just give attention sometimes. That's that's fine. He's gonna attack me in a second. Go this way. There you go. Okay. Let's keep packing. Actually, I'm gonna drink. Let's go. So this second half turning up to be pretty dope. Monkey. It's not a monkey, it's an ape. To more Battle Rage, Twisted Abomination, Conclave Naturalists, The Chatter Squirrel, Sickle Slicer, Balduvian Rage, we got? we got the Sift, Sanctum Spirit, Dark Steel Citadel, Brimstone Volley, yes, the Golem Artisan, very nice, and a rare Thought Reflection, very nice, if you would draw a card, draw two cards instead, and Tempered Steel. Okay, and we got a Foil Saw Bay Mage. And clone shell. Okay. Very cool. Very cool, very cool. Let's go. I want the worm. Give me the worm. Ooze. Okay, we got Goblin Gavalier. Revoke existence. I revoke your existence, sir. Might of the masses. Cloud Reader Sphinx. Sickle Slicer. Skin Wing. Argivian Restoration. We have an unfortunate situation here. We got the Crib Swap. Spring Leaf Drum. Chief of the Foundry. That's a nice, dope card. We got Celesnia Guild Mage. And then we got a Mythic Mana Echoes. We got the Echoes again. That's a big hit. And then we got the Duplicant. It's okay. And then, for our foils, Apprentice Wizard and Gleaming Barrier. Okay. We got another Echoes. I say another because I have one and I love it. So, bada bing, bada boom. Yeah. All right. Let's keep it going. I was just thinking, we're not, we didn't get too many mythics in this, but that's starting to pick up, so I'm not going to say anything else. <laughs> Servo. Okay. Heartless Pillage. A braid. Supernatural stam Stamina is what everybody wishes they had, if you catch my drift. Ancient Stirrings. Bauduvian Rage. Sift. Mur Retriever, 
Alabaster Salt Bay Mage. We got the Manamorphs. Manamorphus. That's getting sleeved. Very good. We got Calling Dice. Lightning Greaves. And Rare Sword of the Meek. So equipped creature gets plus one, plus two. Equip takes two. Whenever a 1-1 one, one creature enters the battlefield under your control, you may return Sword of the Meek from your graveyard to the battlefield. Then attach it to that creature. Very nice. And then we got Master Transmuter. Who is she? I'll tell you. She's the Master Transmuter. Chippy. Chippy drew this card. And a foil battle rattle shaman. <laughs> and a foil dark steel axe. Okie dokie. Artichoke. I'm gonna get this metamorphosis. Though it's an uncommon, I would most certain. This is, this is a dope card. Add two mana in any combination of any colors. <laughs> Draw a card. Wow. My, this second half. Killing it. Germ. All right, we got the Sylvan Might. Dark Steel Axe. Regular. The Tabor Battle Rage. Iron League Steed, is that a rhino? Kinda, I don't know. Does it say, oh, haste, I thought it said human. I said, that's a lie, sir. Expedition map, another Frogify, the Iron Bully. Thrabin Inspector, Gelatinous Genesis. <laughs> Hell yeah. Create how many X, X how, how many, how many, how many, Green ooze creature tokens, depending on what, how many you choose. Wow. Okay. That's pretty nice. E wait, let's, what's, what's the flavor text? Even as the world was left cracked and gory by the marauding Eldrazi, new life began to drip from its wounds. Disgusting. Mishra's factory. Trash for treasure. Then we got the Well of Ideas. I have a good idea. And we got the Ion Storm. All right. And our foil, we got another, we got Mishra's Factory. Do you hear this cat? It's like she, it's like she loves me and she wants me to love her. And an uncommon Glass Dusk Hulk foil. Okay. There we go. Would you believe if I said, I only have five more packs left? I don't believe it. I feel like I'm missing one, but I dug more too. I don't want to stop opening packs, but I'm out of packs. I'm almost out of packs. But I will continue to drink some bubbles. Okay, so we got five more packs left. First stream of 2021. Not bad. It is not bad at all. Not the things I'm like looking for, but I can't be mad. I can't be mad at all. Guess I just need to get another box of double masters. For me. Fart in. I can't believe that's like the first time I've burped. On a stream. That's probably the lie. We got Mer. Fierce Empath. Executioner's Capsule. Right on. Sacrifice Executioner's Capsule. Destroy target non-block creature. Cathartic Reunion. A different Cathartic Reunion. I have so many of these in Aquaria, but it's a man and a dinosaur. Blood Rar. Iron League Steed. Expedition Map again. Frogify again. Strength of Arms, or Salvagers, Yavi Maya's Embrace. We got the Skull Mulcher, just mulching skulls. 
And then we got, we got the Shusher. The Shusher. And the Blink Moth Nexus, which is very dope. It's very simple. I'll take it. What, what, are, what are our foils? What do we got? We got the Parasitic Strix foil. Very nice. And then we got the shapes. We got foiled shapes, everybody. I feel like you should know. We got the shapes. The shusher's getting he, he, he the shusher's getting sleeved. Thank you, Cyril Vanderhagen. You listen to what this man says. He shush. Maybe I'll leave the light on. It's not super glary. Uh, let's do it for this pack and we'll see what happens. Alright. I'm not starting off strong looking at the top card. We got our salivating gremlins. Heartless pillage. A bread. The Murr Retriever. Ursa's mine. Um, we'll go nicely with the tower. Uh, Metallic Rebuke. Metal Spinner's Puzzle Knot. Just please remember the fallen. Valor and Akros. Oval Chase Daredevil. We got the Pentad Prism. Boom, baby. We got the Dark Steel Forge. We did. Very nice. That's getting sleeved. And we got Jace the Mind Sculptor. Two big hits. Two big hits out of this pack. Can we go for three? Maybe even four? No. And no. <laughs> but hey, baby. Would you look at this? Let me sleeve these boys up right now. Two mythics in a pack. That's a hell of a hit if I've seen one. And actually, Jace is one of the planeswalkers that I don't have. And I love Jace. He's, I mean, usually a villain. But let's look. Let's have a look see. So Dark Steel Forge, that's a 10. Jace, however, 49. I mean, it's no Force of Will, obviously, and it's no Mana Crypt, but it's pretty big. Pretty big. Damn. How many packs we got going? How many more packs we got? We got three. Three more packs. And our Double Masters 2021 New Year stream box. Feeling good things. Feeling good things. I'm going to top myself off. Because ever since I did, only good things have happened. So. You need a drink? Go get a drink. This is Boosters. We're getting boozy. Oh my, what a last pack. That last pack was huge. Okay. Let's see. We got a beast. Okay. A braid. Supernatural stanim stan stamina. It's not stanima. Ancient stirrings. Brainstorm. We got the Cathodian. Adorable. Ursa's power plant. We got like all of Ursa's things. If you control an Ursa's mind and an Ursa's tower, add two instead. That's dope. We got all of those. Steel Sabotage, the Ancestral Blade, 
Uh, it's a white, so I can't put it in my deck. All right, we got the Sandstone Oracle. Do you hear this cat? Hold on. Stop. Alanis. Stop. 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 Oh. Ugh. Cat just playing with paper bags. She just finds them, she pulls them down, and she goes, ah, da, da, da. All right, let's finish this. Let's finish this pack. Okay, we got the Sandstone Oracles, Ash Barons, Esperzoa. We got the jellyfish. This is this might go in my deck. Um, flying at the beginning of your upkeep, return an artifact you control to its owner's hands. Well, I don't know why I'd want to do that. So, yeah, uh, unless uh, we'll see. We got the ratchet bomb. <laughs> Some people probably had to dive on the ratchet bomb last night if you catch my drift. If you don't catch that joke, it's you're too young and you shouldn't be watching this anyways. In the comments below, have you ever had to take a dive on the ratchet bomb for a friend? Let me know. We got the ratchet bomb and we got the glimmer void. Let's check it. We got a heartless pillage. In an uncommon rush of knowledge. These foils, like, they're beautiful. We're not getting any huge hits on these foils. Which is fine. I'm not here for that, but it would help. Okay. It was... We got a bone picker. We got a bone to pick with you. Lightning axe. Shapes again. Ursa's mind. Mine, not mind. Metallic rebuke. Metal spinner's puzzle knot. We got a peace strider. Okay. The throbbing. <laughs> you throbbing? Maybe. Inspector. Disciple of the Vault. That's a nice card. Whenever an artifact is put into a graveyard from the battlefield, you may have target... Um, you may have target opponent lose one life. Okay. Oh, Naganata. Dismantle the establishment board by board. If you get that quote, like and comment. Thank you. We got the blood moon, baby. That's a hit. Non-basic lands are now all mountains. And then we got the Archangel of Thune, which is also a hit. And we got Strength of Arms and an Uncommon Unlicensed Disintegration. So Blood Moon and Archangel of Thune are both hits. Those are, that's good cards. So when I see this Blood Moon, it actually reminds me of what I plan on doing tomorrow. So tomorrow, I will be streaming, um, I, I want to start a series of games that I think should have, like, a secret layers. Um, so everybody knows what secret layers are at this point. The Walking Dead ones just were released, and I'm working to get my hands on some of those, because they're dope. I love The Walking Dead. It's really cool. It's a great concept. And then, like, Bob Ross paintings, the Godzilla ones, Godzilla lands. So I'll be streaming video games that I think should have uh, secret layers um, based off of them. And why I say the Blood Moon is because tomorrow I will be streaming Legend of Zelda. Oh my, give me one second. I got cats being cats. Oh. 
Uh, anyways, as I was saying, I will be streaming Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild, and the Blood Moon is a big thing in um, Breath of the Wild. It returns creatures, so I might... I'll do a play on the Blood Moon. Um, but yeah, it'll be dope. So I plan on recording the series, and then I'll be loading... Uploading the videos to YouTube with the different cards and the different card art that I think it should be based on. Or what it would look like. Like the description, what stats it would have, stuff like that. But, speaking of this Blood Moon, let us check some things on the Dawn Glare. So, well, Avo, we got the Opal. Yeah, we got the opal. Where did that go? We did get the opal, right? Yes. That's big. Okay. Um, but we got. Where's the angel of Thune? I saw it. It's not this far up. No. Um, angel of Thune. It's a twelve. Um, Blood Moon, where did you go? Eight, yes. So, that is very cool. Alright, so, let us get go. Oh my golly, oh my damn. We got one more pack left. We got one more pack left in this 2021 stream. We've had some hell of a pools, hell of a pools. Not so much in the front end, I'm gonna be honest, in the, first, in the first half they got us, but in this second half we came back. And boy, did we come back strong. We got some bangers. So let's see what this wormy, what he's got for us. Okay, last pack, best pack. Force of Will. Bring it. We got treasure. All right. Weapon Surge. Sylvan Might. Dark Steel Axe. Timur the Battle Rage. Accomplished Automaton. Parasitic Strix. Flayer Husk, Fortify, The Thopter Foundry, Morgut Banshee, I ain't mad, Clone Shell, and we got a rare Fulminator Mage, and Oblivion Stone, that's cool. Put a fate counter on target permanent. Four and tap it. Five, pay five and tap it. Sacrifice Oblivion Stone. Destroy each non-land permanent without a fate counter on it. Then remove all fate counters from permanents. Interesting. Okay, let, oh yes, please. A foil corridor monitor. Adorable. And skin wing. So nothing great out of that pack. Um, okay. Oh, but okay. Hmm. So, recap as I drink some wine. Wine, who am I? These are bubbles. The bubbly bubbles. So let me get, I'm going to start doing this more often. I'm going to get a pen. And, or in this case, because for whatever reason, I don't have a pen right here. So I'm going to use a crayon because I'm five. And I'm going to write down what we got. Okay. Let me go and tally things up. We're going to see. 
what we made with my handy dandy crayon. Because I'm five. Oh no. Where did Don Glare go? There it is. Okay, so we have, starting from the top, Archangel of Thune, which is. That is 12. Okay. Got 12. The Blood Moon, which I think we said was 8. That is 8. Jace, Mr. Mind Sculptor. 49. We got the Dark Steel Forge, which I believe was also Dark Steel Forge. 10. Okay. We got the Shusher. Actually, let me just. Ooh, too far. The Shishers four. Manamorphous. Mm, it's all the way over here. Three. Mana Echoes. 14. Walking Ballista is a 10. We got the Foil Stone Forge Mystic. So actually, I'll leave fo foils till after. We got the Mox Opal. Opal is 35. Wrath of God, I believe, is a 2 or 4. Is it 4? It's 4. Heartbeat Spring is a 2. Right. Yes. Yes, so that's two. My boy Karn. Where's Karn? Karny Karn Karn. Twenty nine. Rolling Earthquake, I think, was a two. Is it the bottom? Yes. Imperial Recruiter. Is what? Where'd you go? 20. Nice. An Ad Nauseam 8, I think it was. 6. I think it's 6. Yeah, it's six. Okay. So then we go to the foils. Um, let me just. So Stoneforge Mystic twenty four. I don't I think Ursus Tower is like a two. Yeah. Ursus Tower is a two. In the high market. I had a hard time finding this card. It's like a four. Is it four? Um, it's 
not for Where did it go? Um uh, Oh to three. Okay. So, with that being said, this is a lot of numbers. <laughs> Let me see. Let me see. All right. I'm going to disconnect my phone. You see Frida back there? Being a little kitty. So, Ending numbers are And numbers, 237. Considering that's about what I paid for the box, and there's probably other things in here that I could get, um, I could sell and make money off of, I'd say that's a pretty successful box. 237, I think I paid like 212 or something for this box. So that is pretty dope. Um, I will most certainly be doing another double masters box. I actually might order one right now. Do another double masters. I got Kaldheim coming in. Um, I'm gonna do. I'll probably do a set booster box of that. Um, so far, nothing stand out to me where I'm like, I'm gonna make a deck out of this. So I'm gonna get drafts. Um, so I think that's what I'm gonna do. I think I'm going to just go with the set boosters of Kaldheim. I love Norse mythology. I think this is going to be a great, great set when everything's out. I'm not expecting big numbers from this um, box. It's the first box of the year. They're not going to put in... I don't think they're going to throw anything, like, super huge out, out of it. Um, maybe I'll do a set and a draft. I don't know. Maybe I'll do a collector's. Collector's are always just so expensive for what you get. You could be paying 200 and... Like, market price right now is, like, 146 and all the card stores are selling them for, like, 280 270 which I understand they need to make a profit, but double the profit. I guess it's because we don't know what is a potential for these collector's um, packs right now. We don't have all the cards out. We don't have the high price Mythics. We don't, you know, we don't know yet. Um, but... So I'm going to get the set. I will get the set boosters for Kaldheim. Comes out February 5th. So if you guys want to go get that, get that pre-order going. Sounds like a good idea. That's what I'm going to do. Because then as soon as I get that, I'm definitely going to open that on stream. But I need to find more boxes. Also, hey, look. This is Frida. This is Frida. She's the F in fat. But yeah. I need to find more boxes to open. I've opened everything from this year, um, I think. I don't think War of the Spark was this year. Was Throne? Was Th Throne of Eldraine might have been this year. Um, I didn't open that. That was hard to find. So if I can find a Throne of Eldraine, um, but I'm not sure. Let's see. Throne came out in two thousand nineteen. I'm fine. Yeah. So I I did everything from this from this year. I I don't think I think Jumpstart might have came out. I don't count that. Um. Yeah. So this is a very successful opening, and if 
this is any sign for the year to come, I think 2021 is going to be just swell. So, as I said, I'm going to start streaming um, Breath of the Wild, and then I will be porting it over to YouTube, and when it, on the ports over to YouTube, it'll have the card arts for um, what I think a secret layer should be for this series. And the thing is with, like, big video games like that, is that there's going to be a lot. So I have to pick carefully, and I'm only going to do probably, like, ten. I'll pick ten from the series of what, what we should do. So, Wizards, Wizards of the Coast, if you're looking out, wouldn't be a bad idea. Well, sweet. I hope everybody had a fantastic New Year's Eve, New Year's Day. I hope you enjoyed the stream. I hope you stay boozy. I'm going to stay boozy. It's still New Year's Day. I'm not at work today. You better not be either. So, if you enjoyed the stream, if you liked the video, follow us, like the videos, especially on YouTube. Um, if you saw any card here today that you'd like, go over to Instagram.com slash boosters, B, triple O-Z-T-E-R-Z, -E -E there's Lannis. Um, say, hey, you open this and I want this and I will be more than happy to work with you on getting that card to you as fast as possible. Um. <coughs> Woo! Okay. Bless me. Anyways. So yeah, if you see, if you, there's any card here today that you saw that you want, to me message. And also, I'd just love to talk to you. I think it'd be great to get to know people watching the videos. Um, so yeah, like the videos on YouTube, YouTube, it's actually, um, if you go to the Instagram page, it'll take you there. There's going to be a YouTube link here. Um, it has all the videos of all the box openings we've done. So Hannah and I are actually, Hannah hasn't been on a video in a long time. We did like three videos with Hannah on it. And then I started doing Sudsy Saturdays where I'd get some local beers and drink those and open a box. We have plans for 2021. I'll just say that. You'll be seeing a lot more of Hannah. Probably more of these kitties. We got cocktails. We'll have wine. We'll have beer. We're going to stay boozy. It's going to be great. I'm adding video game content. I'm, I might get into the uh, streaming arena scene. Because I plan on working my ways up those ranks um and i've been doing pretty good on arena i'm just nervous i don't want to embarrass myself but i'm relatively new to playing magic it's been a couple months um i'm all about collecting this pandemic had to give me a hobby and this was it so i thank you all i hope you have a fantastic 2021 and i hope you stick around and subscribe to boosters for this boozy content so stay boozy ladies gentlemen germs cats dogs i don't know what you are but you're you and we respect you and thank you for coming go get a drink happy new year mm -hmm.